Hello everyone, it's Pat at Beads and Plenty More, and today I'm going to show you how to make this bracelet. We called it the Linked Hearts Bracelet, and we also have a kit made up with it. Uh, I have in this particular color, I've got the uh, glass pearls, this 8mm glass pearls, and a 3mm of a gunmetal spacer. So, let's get started. We also, I used a toggle and one meter of eight pound fire line. I used a heavier fire line because it is a little bit more substantial bracelet with the two strands. So I've already threaded my two needles. We need two needles. And I found the center of the fire line and put it through the loop of the toggle clasp. And so then I'm gonna feed these needles through like that so that I've got a loop that will come up here and pull up to, oops, I didn't get it through right. So we will bring the needles through that loop. It's probably easier with the, out the needles threaded, but I didn't think you'd want to watch me threading needles because that does take a little bit of time. There we go, we got a nice little loop on there. Okay, nice and strong. So that's the start of the bracelet at one end. And we take one of the little uh, spacer beads, separate my needles out. I'm gonna put that on the needle, on one needle and let it go down here. And then we take the other needle and reverse it on that single bead. Now this is kind of the trick of the whole bracelet is that it has this bead that has the thread going each direction. So it sets the bead kind of square instead of going a round shape. So that's the beginning of the bracelet. Then we're gonna put one of the pearls on and it goes on both, this particular one will go on both needles one needle through and then the other. And this is the what we have for the start of the bracelet and it also will come at the end. We have a single bead at each end of the bracelet, one on each end. Okay, so that's my start. And then I'm going to go ahead and separate these threads and we'll put on three of the uh, metal spacer beads and one of the pearl beads, the eight millimeter pearls. There we go. Slide all that down. And we're going to do the same for the other side. Two, three, and one. And then we're going to do the same thing with one single bead and go through one direction with one needle and come back with the other needle and go through the other direction. And this is what is the kind of the whole magic of this whole bracelet is to get these beads sitting so that it makes the V shape there. So that's how it goes, and we just continue to do that with three uh, metal beads and one pearl on each side, like that. And then when I get down to the other end of the toggle, I'm going to show you how to do that. So we'll just con this would be just continuing on with the three, three, three until you get the right size, and then the end is a little bit different. So I'll show you how to do that. Okay, I'm back with my bracelet strung up. I've done nine sets of pairs of the uh, glass pearls, the eight millimeter glass pearls. And now at the last one, I'm gonna attach the toggle end. I don't put that bead on, single bead on that, that uh, is reversed. I'm just gonna go ahead and put three of the metal spacer beads on each side. 
And another thing I was going to mention too about working with um, beads that are on a string. Do leave your beads on a string because like the pearls here, I can just pull one off and immediately I can find that the hole is between my fingers there, which makes it much easier to find the hole. So I'm gonna string this single pearl on both threads that just like we did when at the beginning, had both of the threads go through the one pearl. And so we get that same V, but it's going the other direction. And then we're gonna go into a single, my threads organized here, a single metal, a three millimeter bead, that will be the bead that goes just before we go into the toggle part. So we'll go one little bead and go through with both needles. And bring that up nice and snug. So that's the end of the bracelet. Now we're going to attach this um, bar part of the toggle on here. So what I would like to do here is bring the thread through at least twice for each uh, of my needles so that I get four threads coming through this uh, little toggle bar. One time and one more. And then we'll just pull all of those up so that we snug everything up, get rid of all the gaps in the thread. There's a little gap there. There we are. So then these can go, I can thread them through here, make that nice and snug. And I'm going to wrap one to the other side of the single bead there, and then I'll tie the two together. I still left the needles on because the, I'm going to go through a little further down. So tie the two together, which kind of ends it somewhat. And then I'm going to also thread through this single bead. Lots of threads. Thread with my one needle. And then thread with the other one. And then once again, I'm going to tie the two together at this point. Nice and snug with a second knot as well. And then I will also go back through this single pearl before I cut my threads. Go through there and with one needle and the other needle. And at that point I'm ready to cut the threads. I'll cut these off and we have a finished bracelet. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.